Hello friends, welcome back to our tutorial designing an impressive architectural building in Intricat 2018 in If you have been following along in this tutorial, go and open the file 00 underscore 024 underscore DIAB where you save it. You can also go and download this file from my website or you can use your own file. But if you don't have access into the exercise file, you can just sit down and watch. Go to the quick access toolbar and click the save as button. This will bring the save drawing as dialog box. Rename this drawing to 00 underscore 025 underscore DIAB and click the save button. Select this fissure board, right click, isolate, isolate object. Hold down your shift key and your middle mouse button to orbit. Right click the UCS and select the face option. At UCS select face or solid surface prompt. Click on this face. Press enter to accept. Go to the visual style control and change the visual style to 2D wireframe. Go to the home tab, drop panel and select the polyline command. Hold down your shift key and orbit. Start the polyline from this corner to this corner to this corner to this corner. Press enter. Start the polyline command again. Start the line from this corner to this corner. Press enter. Press enter to repeat the polyline command again. Start from this corner to this corner, press enter. Go to the home tab, modify panel and select the offset command. For the offset distance, type 2 inches on your keyboard and press enter. Select this line and offset it up. Select this line, offset up. Select this line and offset up. Press escape to get out of the command. Select this line, this line this line and hit delete on your keyboard go to the home tab modify panel and select the trim command press enter to and trim off this area trim this trim this press escape to get out of the command select the polyline command again start a line from this point to this point press enter select the offset command Enter 2 inches on your keyboard and press enter. Select this line and offset it up. Press escape. Select this line and hit the delete key. Go to the home tab, draw panel and start the line command. Draw a line from this point to this point. Press escape. Orbit into this area. Start the line command. Draw a line from this point and snap perpendicular to this point. Press escape. Right click the UCS and select the face option. Avoid the mouse cursor into this face. Click. Press enter to accept. Start the polyline command. Start the line from this point, this point, and this point. Press enter to end the line command. Go to the home tab, modify panel and select the offset command. Type 2 inches and press enter. Offset this line up. Press escape to get out of the command. Select this line and erase it. Start the polyline command again. Select Start at the end point of this line and snap perpendicular to this line. Press escape to get out of the command. Start the line command and draw a temporal line to this edge. Press escape. Now go to the home tab, modify panel and select the trim command. Press enter. Hold down your shift key and select this line to extend it. Now trim off this line. Type arrow on your keyboard and press enter. Select this line, press enter. Press enter to end the command. Right click the UCS and select the world option. Go to the home tab, drop panel and select the rectangle command. 
start the rectangle command from this corner to this corner. Press enter to repeat rectangle command again. Start the rectangle command from this corner to this corner. Orbit around start the rectangle on the end point of this line and snap it to this end point. Select this this rectangle, this rectangle. Go to the home tab, modify panel, and select the exclude command. Go to the home tab, modify panel, select the offset command. For the offset distance, type two feet on your keyboard and press enter. Select this line and offset it out. Select this offset to this direction. Select this line, offset. Select this line, offset. Select this line offset select this line offset press escape to get out of the command now go to the home tab modify panel and select the fillet command type r and press enter type 0 press enter type m press enter select this line this line this line this line this line this line Select this line, 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 this oops, this line, this line, this line, this line. Press escape to get out of the command. Now select this line, this line and hit delete on your keyboard. Hold down your shift key and orbit around. Type join on your keyboard and press enter. Select this object, this line, this line this line and press enter press enter to repeat the join command select this line this line this line this line this line this line press enter now select this truth polyline go to the surface tab create panel and select the plan AutoCAD converts the figure into surface select this line go to the grey tab and select the extrude panel move the mouse cursor into the move the mouse inside and type two feet on your keyboard press enter press enter to repeat the command again select this polyline press enter move the mouse cursor into this direction type two feet on your keyboard and press enter select this surface this surface this surface this surface and move them to the surface layer press escape to get out of the command right click into the drawing area isolate end object isolation go to the visual style control and change it to realistic go to the quick access toolbar and click the save button Go to the navigation bar and select the orbit command to look around your model. Press escape. Select this. Go to the home tab, layer panel and click the isolate command. Select this object and press enter. Now use a window selection to select all these objects and hit delete key on the keyboard go to the layer panel and select on isolate go to the navigation bar and select the orbit command to orbit around your model go to the quick access toolbar and click the save button all right in this tutorial we'll finish our surface if you like this tutorial please click the like button and share it to your friends if you have any question or you want a specific tutorial, please leave a comment below.
If you want to continue on this series or any other tutorial on my channel, please click the subscribe button. Thanks very much for watching. I hope to see you in the next class. Goodbye.